except for like my doctors, but I, I didn't want to talk about it a lot because I didn't want to seem like I had a concussion. I wanted, I didn't want people to think that I couldn't do things that I want to do, like play sports or do my classes or go places with friends. And so I would just like kind of blow it under the rug and pretend it wasn't as bad as it was when in hindsight, maybe that wasn't the best idea, but, um, I would probably feel more comfortable about it if, uh, I guess if I had other people that had one as well, cause also a concussion, nobody really knows how you're feeling. Nobody knows how bad it is. It's all your, it's your brain. So they can't see the, like, it's not like you have a broken hand or a broken finger. It's completely on what you're telling people. And so I didn't want to seem like over dramatic or anything because nobody can tell but um I would feel more, feel more comfortable if I did have a community I guess to and people who are open about it or were also experiencing the same thing